Hey everyone, did you know that the average person spends about 90 minutes a day just on their phone before even getting out of bed? Imagine what you could achieve if you swapped those 90 minutes with insanely productive morning routines. Welcome to Don't Do This Guide, where we flip the script on common habits and supercharge your life. Today, we're diving into insanely productive morning routines that can transform your day and boost your productivity. If you're tired of groggy mornings and unproductive starts, this video is for you. Stick around and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and like this video if you find any value in it. Let's get started. Now I know what you might be thinking. Waking up early, that's not exactly groundbreaking advice, but hear me out. There's a reason why so many successful people swear by it. It's not about depriving yourself of sleep, it's about optimizing your day. When you wake up early, even just an hour before your usual time, you're essentially carving out an extra hour in your day that most people don't have. Those first few hours of the day, when the rest of the world is still asleep, are pure gold. No distractions, no emails, no phone calls. You set the tone for the day, instead of letting the day control you. Start small. Set your alarm just 15 minutes earlier for a week, then gradually increase it. All right, so you've conquered the first hurdle and woken up early. Congrats. Now, let's talk about what you do with those precious morning hours. The first thing you should be doing is hydrating. Your body just went through six to eight hours of fasting while you were asleep. It's dehydrated. Grab a large glass of water. I'm talking like 16 ounces here and guzzle it down. Water kickstarts your metabolism, flushes out toxins and helps your brain function at its best. Now that you're hydrated, it's time to wake up those muscles with some stretching. Just five to 10 minutes of simple stretches can make a world of difference. Okay, so you've hydrated, stretched, and you're feeling pretty good. These are great first steps to start your day on the right foot. Now let's talk about the power of mindfulness and meditation. These practices can transform your daily routine and overall well-being. In a world that's constantly bombarding us with information and distractions, it's more important than ever to cultivate a sense of inner peace and clarity. This can help you navigate through the chaos with a calm and focused mind. Mindfulness is simply the practice of being present in the moment, without judgment. It allows you to fully experience life as it happens, rather than getting lost in thoughts about the past or future. Meditation, on the other hand, is a more structured practice that involves focusing your mind on a particular object, thought or activity. This can be anything from your breath, a mantra, or even a visualization. The benefits of mindfulness and meditation are well documented. They can help you develop a deeper understanding of yourself and your emotions. They can reduce stress and anxiety, improve focus and concentration, boost creativity, and even increase your emotional intelligence. These benefits can enhance both your personal and professional life. Start small, even just five to 10 minutes of mindfulness or meditation each morning can make a world of difference. Gradually, you can increase the duration as you become more comfortable with the practice. You'll be amazed at how much calmer, more focused and more productive you'll feel throughout the day. This simple addition to your morning routine can set a positive tone for everything that follows. Chapter four, healthy breakfast choices, fueling your body for success. Let's be real. You can't expect to conquer the world on an empty stomach. Breakfast is often called the most important meal of the day and for good reason. It's the fuel that kickstarts your metabolism, provides you with energy and sets the tone for your eating habits throughout the day. But not all breakfasts are created equal. Think whole grains like oatmeal or whole wheat toast, protein packed eggs or Greek yogurt and healthy fats from avocados or nuts. These foods provide sustained energy, keep you feeling fuller for longer and help stabilize your blood sugar levels. And here's a pro tip. Prep your breakfast the night before to save time in the morning. Remember, a healthy breakfast is an investment in your health and productivity. Chapter five, planning and prioritizing conquering your day with a plan. One of the biggest productivity killers is lack of planning. Without a clear roadmap, your day can quickly spiral out of control. When you don't have a clear idea of what you need to accomplish, it's easy to get sidetracked, overwhelmed, and ultimately unproductive. The chaos of an unplanned day can lead to stress and frustration. Take a few minutes each morning to plan out your day. 
This simple habit can set a positive tone and give you a sense of direction. This doesn't have to be anything fancy, a simple to-do list, a calendar reminder, or even just jotting down your top three priorities for the day can make a world of difference. The act of writing things down helps to clarify your thoughts and intentions. The key is to identify your most important tasks, the ones that will move the needle forward in your personal and professional life, and focus on those first. Prioritizing these tasks ensures that you are making progress where it matters most. Break down larger tasks into smaller, more manageable steps and set realistic deadlines. This approach makes daunting tasks feel more achievable and keeps you on track. Use the power of time blocking. Allocate specific time slots for different activities to ensure you stay focused and productive throughout the day. Remember, a plan with focused action is how you turn your goals into reality. By sticking to your plan and taking deliberate steps, you can conquer your day and achieve your objectives. Chapter 6. Learning and Growth. Investing in yourself every day. We live in a world that's constantly evolving, and if you're not growing, you're falling behind. That's why it's crucial to make time for learning and personal growth every single day. And what better time to do it than in the morning when your mind is fresh and receptive? Now, when I say learning, I'm not just talking about formal education. It could be anything that expands your knowledge, skills or perspective. The key is to be intentional about your learning. Embrace it, make it a part of your daily routine and watch as you grow and evolve both personally and professionally. Chapter 7. Exercise and movement boosting your energy and focus. Let's face it. Most of us spend way too much time sitting down, whether it's at work, in front of the TV, or even during our commute. And while it might not seem like a big deal, all that sitting can take a toll on your physical and mental health, leading to issues like back pain, poor posture, and increased stress levels. That's why it's crucial to incorporate some form of exercise or movement into your morning routine. Starting your day with physical activity can set a positive tone for the rest of the day. Even just 30 minutes of moderate intensity exercise most days of the week can make a world of difference. It doesn't have to be intense. Consistency is key. Go for a brisk walk, hit the gym, do some yoga, or find an activity you enjoy and get moving. The important thing is to find something that you look forward to and that fits into your lifestyle. Exercise has countless benefits, both physically and mentally. It can help you maintain a healthy weight, build strength, and improve cardiovascular health. It boosts your energy levels, improves your mood, reduces stress and anxiety, and even helps you sleep better at night. Plus, it can enhance your focus and productivity throughout the day. The key is to make movement a non-negotiable part of your daily routine. By prioritizing exercise, you're investing in your overall well-being and setting yourself up for success. Chapter 8. Journaling and Reflection – Unleashing the Power of Self-Awareness in today's fast-paced world, it's easy to get caught up in the hustle and bustle and lose sight of what truly matters. That's where journaling and reflection come in. Taking just a few minutes each morning to journal and reflect on your thoughts, feelings and goals can have a profound impact on your life. Journaling provides a safe and private space for you to process your emotions, gain clarity on your thoughts and track your progress over time. Start by simply jotting down whatever comes to mind. You can write about your dreams, your goals, your fears, your gratitude, anything that feels relevant in the moment. Once you've finished writing, take some time to reflect on what you've written. Journaling and reflection are powerful tools for self-discovery and personal growth. Chapter 9. Avoiding distractions, protecting your productivity zone. Distractions are productivity killers. They're the enemy of focus, the thieves of time, and the ultimate saboteurs of success. One of the simplest yet most effective strategies is to create a distraction-free environment. This means silencing your phone, turning off notifications and closing any unnecessary tabs or windows on your computer. If you're working from home, let your family or roommates know that you're not to be disturbed. Identify your biggest distractions and then find ways to minimize or eliminate them. Start small. Set aside just 30 minutes of distraction-free time each morning and gradually increase it over time. You'll be amazed at how much more you can accomplish when you're not constantly being bombarded by distractions. And there you have it, an insanely productive morning routine that can transform your life. 
Start implementing these habits and watch how your productivity soars. Remember, it's not about being perfect. It's about making small, sustainable changes that add up to big results over time. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button, subscribe to Don't Do This Guide, and share this with anyone who could use a productivity boost. And be sure to let me know in the comments below which of these strategies you're most excited to try. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.